56 years of experience, 6 colleges, 150 full professors, a library with over 70,000 online publications, a student population of 50,000 and growing, over 400 academic programs, leading local university and among the highest ranked in the region. All these found in one institution, the University of Nairobi. Commonly referred to as Maine, the University of Nairobi remains the university of choice within the region, offering quality higher education. Everybody applies to the University of Nairobi for the top professional courses. It's very unfortunate. They already know. And then they go to the others. Our strength is in the human resource capacity. Like I said, a university with over 350 professors, we have more than 50% of all the full professors in the country, we have 110. The university continues to produce some of the greatest minds to impact the world, such as Nobel Prize laureate Professor Wangari Madhai. The professor can only promise to build on its strengths and opportunities, ensuring that it serves the current and future needs of society. Yes, out there, we have many people, former students of this university. And I want to start with our Prime Minister, a very energetic man, that Wangari Madhai, a former dawn of this university. And recently, in fact, we came up with the Wangari Mother Institute. Yes, which will be in College of Agriculture and Veterinary Sciences. Again, the whole idea is to nurse young and coming scientists to come to that level. Our primary objective is really to mold somebody who will be able to be part of the healthcare team. So in this college, that's why we are training uh, medical doctors, dentists. As the university celebrates its 44th graduation ceremony on the 3rd of December, featuring the College of Health Sciences and the College of Humanities and Social Sciences, one can only stop to marvel at the strides made over the years. What has it been like for the students who can now see the finish line? So far, I can say my experience has been awesome. I'm now in fourth year. The past three years have been great. They've given us the right content. It's been quite tough, but uh, it's been challenging, but in a good way, it kind of influenced. Uh, it's changed my life. I'm a better person, I guess, right now. As in, you appreciate uh, nature, appreciate uh, people. This, as in, you get to see the smile on their face when you heal. Outlook of life generally. And uh, I've also acquired skills to help me live with people, social skills. Yeah, I appreciate the university. I've been able to meet very, um, very good mentors, even in my experience through the medical school. At the end of one's education at the university, one is ready for industry. But yet, uh, just, you know, um, living as you and me in a normal way. Uh, being a doctor takes guts and uh, it's the, the very moment I was in Barnes unit, I got to see people who've been burnt to very horrific uh, extents, but yet being able to get past the fear of helping another human being uh, actually has been a wow moment. If you don't learn, if you don't read, you don't know what opportunities are out there for you. What I, I can say I can take away besides my academics would be I have attended so many social networks that have, have been not only a form of entertainment but I've been able to create networks myself. The 44th graduation of the University of Nairobi represents the release into industry of highly qualified graduates ranging from lawyers, judges, advocates, doctors, dentists, nurses, entrepreneurs, economists, among others who are capable of meeting the demands of the industry.
It's going to be a glorious moment for these graduates who have been through the grinding mill and have come out as refined individuals. Another testament of the truest nature of education, which is the hallmark of the University of Nairobi.